Okay, this is the second part of Wildwood Flower. Let me go ahead and play for you the song in its entirety, and we're going to break down the second part of the song, okay? So here's Wildwood Flower. You all should be familiar and know already the first part after watching the first video. So here we go. Wildwood Flower. Okay, what we're going to do is we're going to break down the second part. We've already, so we're going to go, we've already learned this part. A little hammer on. Right? So what we want to do next is we want to introduce this part. And let's go through. We're starting on the fourth fret. And so we're going to move from our fourth to our... 5th, 6th, 7th. So it's going to be an alternation between 4th and 7th. 4, 7, 9. 4, 7, 9. Let's do that again, slowly. Ready? 1, 2, 3, 4. 4, 7, 9. Okay, you can recognize this. I know it's difficult looking at it from the opposite direction here. But your fourth fret is in between the first and second dots, right? Your seventh fret is the third dot, and then your ninth fret is right before the fourth dot, okay? So let's play this. And then we're going to have, again, one of those little lovely hammer-ons that we were working on in the first part of the song. We're going to incorporate this next. Nine, ten. So we're doing 9, 10, 9. Let's do that. Ready? Okay. Let's break that down. 4, 7, 9, 9, 10, 9, 7. Ready? Pause it. I'm going to play it slowly. I pause it after I do this and play that part a couple of times. Pause it and play that, okay? Here's what we're going to do after that. So we're going back to the four, okay? So we're going four, seven, nine, nine, ten, nine, seven, four. Let's break that part down, okay? So we have so far four, seven, nine, 9, 10, 9, 7, 4, 5, 7, 5, 4. Let's play that again. Really take some time to get this. We're going to play it slowly again. Ready? 4, 5, oops. Four, seven, nine, nine, ten, nine, seven, four, four, five, seven, five, four. Let's do it again. One, two, three, four. Four, seven, nine, nine, ten, nine, seven, four, four, five, seven, five, four. Okay? Practice that and play that a couple of times in succession, okay? I want to, this is my favorite part of the song here that's coming up. We're going to do four, five, four, seven, nine, nine, ten, nine. Then we go all the way back down to the first fret. We're going to play this. Ready? Let's just work on this part. That's the, this is what we're doing. That's all we're doing really is we're playing, holding the first finger down and we're strumming and we're hammering on. This is much, very similar to the fills we were doing. It's kind of the opposite way of doing a fill. We were doing this earlier. 
this is going to be opposite. You're putting a finger down rather than taking it off. So we're going to go like this. Ready? Watch me. So your strum, your finger goes down after the strum, much like it goes off during the fill after the strum. So you go, and the way you get that sound, though, it's all picking mechanics. It's all picking. So look at my, look at my, okay? We're going to do... So let's add this part. Let me add, let me show you this melody real quick. We're going to go 4, 7, 9, 9, 10, 9, 7, 4, 4, 5, 7, 5, 4. Down to the first fret. So you're doing 1, 2, and slide into the fourth. Let's play that a couple of times. 1, 2, Back to the first fret. Let's play that again. Ready? So you go two, one, two, two, one, one, two, one, open. Let me show you that with my um, my frets here. Okay, so we're gonna go. Let's play the entirety of the second part together. I want you to put this together with the first part. We're going to start here on the fourth. Ready? We're going to do it slowly. We're going to go four, five, nine. I know this is a little bit more difficult than the first part of the song, but practice makes perfect, so good luck, pause the video whenever you need to, and um, you'll have this polished in no time.